All right, here we go. Another summer program. Shake a shake a. <laughs> oh my goodness. What are you going to get? I want to get a pizza one. Insects. Oh, you got insects? Yay! I'm going to get to look for ladybugs. Ladybugs. Yeah, I love ladybugs. Okay, so we're going to make spring insect wind socks with the toilet paper rolls. <laughs> we're going to make a beehive gift for your grandmas. Okay. And we're going to make this really cool thing called Bugs on a Branch. And then you get to watch Bugs Life, Maya the Bee, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. There's so many movies about insects. I love Maya the Bee. One time I watched it on kids' YouTube on my, um, yeah. my tablet. Yes. And then for dinner, we're going to eat ants on a log. What are ants? It's what? just raisins and celery. And then we're going to eat honey chicken so that you can taste honey that the bees make. Yeah, I love honey. And we have a few books you can read. We're gonna do The Very Hungry Caterpillar and The Very Busy Spider. Oh yeah. Are you so excited for insects? Yeah, I'm so excited to look for ladybugs. Yes, okay, here we go. So I painted these and you see that these are pretend like those are branches and these are like bugs and I did all my favorite colors. That's my favorite color, pink, and my dad's favorite color is blue. And my, my mom's favorite color is purple and pink and I like purple and pink too. And I bet daddy loves probably blue and red. And then we're gonna put polka dots on it. We're gonna draw eyes on them. Yeah. And then we're gonna put little holes on the green felt and then we're gonna stick yeah. them through. Yeah, we're gonna stick them through. And I already know that because I saw it on that picture. Yeah. Yeah. So here's the finished project. Lila made three of them. Mm -hmm. What we'll color? You got a pink one. Mm -hmm. That's me with the eyelashes, mm -hmm. and the blue one, the dark blue one, is um, my dad purple, and that's my mama. Oh, very mm -hmm. cute. You have fun making these? Yeah, really had fun. And okay, so Lila's making a bug out shirt with all her favorite insects. So. We're gonna do three insects. What are they? Um, a bee, a ladybug, and my favorite one, a butterfly. Butterflies. You ready to get started? Yeah. All right. Okay, so we're gonna do three bees, mm -hmm. and then three butterflies, and three ladybugs. So you can wanna space them out, make sure they're all not near each other. So the way we did that was two stamps right on top of each other. Ooh, get that second one a little more. So what are we using for the stamps, Lila? Um, we're using them to make the, the, the bodies and now we're done making the bees. Now we're gonna do my, my, yeah. my second favorite one, the, the um, ladybugs, because when they crawl on us, they tickle us. <laughs> but to make the bodies, we're just using wine corks. Yeah, wine corks. Yeah, cool stamps, huh? Mm -hmm. Perfect. And then do the other, the second dot, remember, just like the B. So, um, we're done making all the bodies. Now we're gonna let them dry, and then when they're done drying, we're gonna add the details like the eyes and the wings and like the like, um, antlers yeah, or ant antennas. Antennas, like <laughs> not anything. antlers. And legs and and feet. stingers. It's okay if you make mistakes. It makes it look more like art, huh? Yeah. 
Yeah, and then I just use that paint, and then I put make the two look like other ones. And that was my mom, and I made that one. But wait, I need to put the like the arms and legs so it don't walk. Yeah, go for it. Mine, but I need to finish it. And now I kind of want to do the stripes, and we need to put some singing, but it won't sting you because it's a nice bee, and I love bees so much because they make us some yummy sweet honey. Wow, this is so hard to do, and it's hurting my hand so much. I keep, I need to wiggle my hand. You're doing a good job. <laughs> We're gonna do the wings, okay? Yeah, and I painted this all black, but not on the inside. I kind of paint the inside with my fingers because my fingers are really painted. No. Today, now I'm gonna do the dots, and my dad cut this out because he is very sharp scissors, and if we cut ourselves, we don't want to cut ourselves because because we get or maybe a knife pick. A knife cut or maybe a scissors cut. Now I glued the wings on. I just need to put some googly eyes and. Oh, that's pretty cool so far. What's missing? Oh, the antenna. antenna. All right, we're gonna do that with pipe cleaners. Uh, yeah. Hold on, let me find some. Now I'm coloring this one orange because now I finished my this one, but now I'm gonna make up. Bumblebee. Cool. Right there you go. So Lila painted the uh, painted it yellow and put two black stripes and somehow there's paint on her face too. I wonder yeah. what happened. Yeah. All right. Now we're gonna put. Oh, oh. we gotta put the wings. Oh, you're, you're, you're. What are you doing next? Um, the attack and then I'm gonna do the smile. Okay. Did it. There it is. Here. I made them. Now they're best friends. They're like um me and Sophia at my school. Is this fun? Mm-hmm, and um, it's starting to already, already look like a beehive. You're gonna press it down on some paper, yeah, like a stamp. Has it all painted? I'm gonna put the paper on top. And then Lila's gonna push down on it just enough. Get a nice little design going on here. I think I'm done. Okay, pull them up and let's see. Oops. Stuck. It kind of didn't work, but it looks good. So after it was done drying, we cut them out into honeycomb shapes, and then Lila drew or wrote "sweet as honey," and we're gonna send these to her grandma's. We have honey chicken. Yeah, where does, nice. Where does honey come from? Bees. And oh. honey is so yummy. We can make like um honey butter. Yeah, we can make all kinds of stuff. And then we have cabbage, 
apple and celery slaw mm -hmm. and how do vegetables happen like we plant seeds but we also need what animal to help bees they so they um like they put do they put like pollen in there and yeah. then make them grow yeah that's right mm -hmm. they put pollen in our fruits and vegetables and then they, they grow and grow and grow and then they get so tasty and healthy for us that's right so are bees important uh-huh did you know that bees were named the most important animal on the planet Without bees, you know what would happen? No, we won't have vegetables or fruit or no honey. That's right, and then you know what would happen? We'd probably starve. Yeah, and then we have no food except we just need to eat candy, but candy's not healthy for us. That's right. Okay, enjoy your food. Is that the shirt you made? I'm gonna get up. Okay, show us. What does the shirt say? It says bug out, and it means like bug out. That means, and I'm a girl, so it means, means bug out girl. Oh, bug out girl. And then look at all those cute little bugs you did. And my favorite bugs are the butterflies and the ladybugs. Okay, Lila, so you watched a lot of TV, different movies about insects and bees and crickets and ladybugs and butterflies and you made your beautiful insect wind socks yeah. <coughs> bless you <laughs> you did your bug out shirt you mm -hmm. tried to go look for ladybugs but it was too hot huh yeah too bad the sun was biting us maybe it should be a little cold and a little hot like kind of yeah a little cold and warm and we did those honey um, gifts for your grandmas. We'll send those out later. Yeah, and when we had dinner, so good. Yeah, we had that honey chicken, huh? Okay, here's my question. What insect is your favorite insect? Ladybugs and butterflies. Why? Because when ladybugs crawl on us, they kind of tickle us. But I kind of don't like them because poop on us. <laughs> so yeah. what insect do you think has the most important job? <laughs> Bees because they collect nectar and they make fruits and vegetables for us. And honey, huh? Mm, and I love their sweet honey. We can make like all kinds of stuff. Like we can use honey as frosting. We can make frosting <laughs> and plum cake and That's cookies. true. And use it as a natural sweetener. Mm -hmm. So this question's kind of hard. Which insect is the strongest? insect who can carry the most weight Me? you saw a movie about it. it's ants oh yeah and because they can hear like a um, big like they can hear yeah. like um 50 ants at his own size that's right look at you is there anything else you learned about insects uh yeah i how important they are that's yeah, right because they're really important cuz but the misport the po the really important animal is i mean instead is the bees because they make sweet honey for us and they use nectar and make and they, a po they ton. yeah they pollinate all the plants yeah and they make a ton of yummy fruits and vegetables and i love the fruit and i really love some vegetables like broccoli and tomatoes and lettuce and carrots yeah so and bees are really important to tomatoes especially like our tomato plants out there yeah. the bees have to go from flower to flower in order for um the tomatoes to grow on the vine yeah and i like potatoes i don't know if bees help potatoes i'm sure in some way <coughs> oh, goodness. i love all of the anxious in the world because i love them so much and they're so beautiful and helpful yay mm -hmm.